So Jack Sheffer, who co-wrote Captain Marvel, is officially going to continue on with the MCU, specifically with Scarlet Witch and the Vision. Now, of course, I think many of you know that the Marvel Cinematic Universe is expanding in different directions. Not just small-time TV with smaller budgets. They're expanding into that, you know, big top-level, Hollywood-level budgets now with their TV series. Six to eight to ten episodes, you know, they're going to be hiring the actors that are in the movies that they don't want to give solo movies to, but they want to expand upon their story. We heard a while ago, Scarlet Witch, Vision, they're guaranteed. And now they have an official writer and somebody that's going to be producing this. So honestly, with Jack attached, I think this is all signs pointing to, you know, they're gearing up for early pre-production before they start getting into it. Now, at the same time, a lot of people are wondering, what is taking so long? It's a TV series. And you have to understand, um, this isn't just a TV series, not for Kevin Feige, you know? Yeah, you could approach it like any TV series, right? have cheap concept art, cheap ideas, but if Kevin Feige is going to be overseeing this, after overseeing some 20 plus MCU movies, he's going to want his hands directly involved in it. They're going to want high production concept art, high, you know, high production stages, sound stages transform. They're going to want this to look like it's top level MCU. So when you go from movie to TV series, there's no disconnect there, right? I mean, for example, I'm not insulting it because you guys know I love the Marvel TV series. I love Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. But there's a clear drop in quality there when you went from Avengers with Coulson to him appearing in Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Same thing with the Extremis formula that was in the first season of, you know, the series. And same thing with like Ghost Rider effect with the whole Doctor Strange gateway. It, there's a little bit of that in there. They don't want that. They want this when you watch it. You're like, oh, wow, I'm watching like an eight-hour movie based on Scarlet Witch and Vision. And that's their goal that's what they want for people and that's why it's taken so long so now that they're gearing up into pre-production you're probably going to assume that they're going to begin into this late towards the end of the year because loki is coming as well as well as a few other series <laughs> 